Dear friends, welcome back to Dear Competitive Exams. Today, we are continuing our midwifery series, a complete step-by-step -step journey through all the important topics that will help you score high in your nursing exams. And this is our second topic, that is physiological changes during pregnancy, where we study about top physiological changes during pregnancy. Those are very important for nursing and competitive exams. And friends, if you have not watched the first video of this series, that is anatomy of the female reproductive system, then please check it out. The link is in the description below. So let's start today's session. Which hormone is primarily responsible for maintaining pregnancy? Your options are estrogen, progesterone, oxytocin or prolactin. The right answer is B that is progesterone. Progesterone maintains the uterine lining for implantation. It prevents uterine contractions and supports fetal growth throughout the pregnancy. Question number 2. During pregnancy, blood volume increases mainly to maintain body temperature, provide oxygen and nutrients to the fetus, increase blood pressure or prevent anemia. The right answer is B that is to provide oxygen and nutrients to the fetus. Maternal blood volume increases by 30 to 50 percent to ensure adequate supply to the growing fetus and placenta. Question number 3. Cardiac output during pregnancy decreases, remains constant, increases or stop temporarily. The right answer is C that is increases. Cardiac output rises by about 30 to 40 percent due to higher heart rate and stroke volume to meet fetal and maternal demands. Question number 4. The increase in renal blood flow during pregnancy helps in hormone production, waste removal from fetus and mother, reducing heart rate or decreasing urine formation. The correct answer is B that is waste removal from fetus and mother. The renal blood flow and GFR increase to exerate fetal and maternal metabolic wastes efficiently. Question number 5. Which respiratory changes occurs during pregnancy? Two options are decreased tidal volume, increased oxygen consumption, decreased respiratory rate or increased CO2 retention. The right answer is B that is increased oxygen consumption. Oxygen demand rises due to fetal growth and increased maternal metabolism leading to deeper breathing. Question number 6. Which system shows the earliest changes during pregnancy? Two options are respiratory system, cardiovascular system, cardiovascular system, nervous system or musculoskeletal system. The right answer is B that is cardiovascular system. Cardiac output and plasma volume begin to rise early in pregnancy. These changes support increased utero-placental circulation. Question number 7. Which hormone is responsible for breast enlargement during pregnancy? Two options are oxytocin, estrogen, testosterone or thyroxine. The right answer is B that is estrogen. Estrogen promotes growth of breast ducts and tissues. It prepares the breast for lactation along with 
register it on. Question number 8. A common gastrointestinal change during pregnancy is diarrhea, constipation, ulcer formation or increased hunger. The right answer is B that is constipation. Progesterone relaxes smooth muscles, slowing bowel movement. This results in constipation during pregnancy. Question number 9. Which musculoskeletal change occurs due to pregnancy hormones? Two options are muscle tightening, ligament relaxation, bone hardening or reduced joint movement. The right answer is B that is ligament relaxation. Relaxin and progesterone cause softening of ligaments. This helps in pelvic expansion for childbirth. Question number 10. Why do pregnant women often experience shortness of breath? Two options are decreased lung capacity, pressure of the uterus on the diaphragm, anemia only or reduced oxygen need. And the correct answer is B that is pressure of the uterus on the diaphragm. The enlarged uterus pushes the diaphragm upward. This limits lung expansion and causes breathlessness. Question number 11. Dear friends, kindly pause the video for a second for your quality purpose. Dear friends, congratulations, you have completed 10 questions successfully. Can you tell me out of these 10, how many did you get correct? Comment your score below right now. Let's see who's on top. Let's continue to the question number 11. Which change occurs in blood pressure during early pregnancy? Your options are it increases sharply, it decreases slightly, it remains unchanged or it fluctuates daily. The right answer is B that is it decreases slightly. Peripheral vasodilation causes a mild fall in blood pressure. It usually normalizes in the later months. Question number 12. Which hormone softens the cervix during pregnancy? Two options are relaxin, oxytocin, estrogen or LH. The right answer is A that is relaxin. Relaxin increases cervical flexibility. It also relaxes pelvic joints to prepare for delivery. Question number 13. Why does the mother's pulse rate increases in pregnancy? Two options are hormonal imbalance, increased cardiac output, anxiety or dehydration. The right answer is B that is increased cardiac output. The heart works harder to pump more blood. Maternal pulse rises by about 10 to 15 beats per minute. Question number 14. Which skin change is commonly seen in pregnancy? Two options are pallor, linea nigra, blistering or peeling. The right answer is B that is linea nigra. Increased melanocyte activity causes dark pigmentation. A dark line appears on the abdomen called linea nigra. Question number 15. Which hormone causes nausea and vomiting in early pregnancy? Two options are estrogen, progesterone, HCG or relaxin. The right answer is C that is HCG. Human chorionic gonadotropin rises rapidly in early pregnancy. High levels trigger morning sickness. Question number 16. Why do gums become swollen or bleed easily during pregnancy? 
few options are vitamin deficiency increased estrogen and blood flow low calcium or infection the right answer is b that is increased estrogen and blood flow hormonal changes increases gum vascularity this causes tenderness and bleeding on brushing question number 17 which change in the urinary system is normal in pregnancy the options are reduced urination increased frequency of urination blood in urine or painful urination and the correct answer is b that is increased frequency of urination the enlarging uterus presses on the bladder increased renal function also adds to urinary frequency the enlarging uterus presses on the bladder increased renal function also adds to urinary frequencies question number 18 which hematologic change is seen during pregnancy Two options are decrease in plasma volume, hemoglobin rise, physiological anemia, or platelet increase. The right answer is C. That is physiological anemia. Plasma volume rises more than red cell mass. This hemodilution leads to mild anemia. Question number nineteen. Basal metabolic rate. BMR during pregnancy decreases remains same increases or stop temporarily the right answer is c that is increases fetal growth and maternal tissue metabolism elevate BMR it helps in meeting energy needs for pregnancy question number 20 Which of the following is a normal endocrine change in pregnancy? Two options are decreased thyroid activity, increased insulin resistance, low cortisol level, or low estrogen. The right answer is B. That is increased insulin resistance. Placental hormones reduce insulin sensitivity. This ensures glucose availability for fetal growth. Question number twenty-one: What causes edema in the legs during pregnancy? Two options are infection, venous pressure from the uterus, high blood sugar, or high salt intake. The right answer is. B that is venous pressure from the uterus the growing uterus compresses pelvic veins this leads to pooling of blood and mild swelling in legs question number 22 which organ enlarges during pregnancy due to hormonal changes two options are spleen liver thyroid or pancreas The right answer is C. That is thyroid. Estrogen increases thyroid binding globulin levels. The thyroid enlarges slightly to meet metabolic demand. Question number twenty-three: Which pigment change occurs on the face during pregnancy? The options are: or albinism, chlorosma, freckles. or rash the right answer is b that is chlorosma the chlorosma also known as mask of pregnancy it is dark pigmentation on the cheeks forehead and upper lip question number 24 which cardiovascular symptom is normal in pregnancy two options are palpitation chest pain fainting spells or cyanosis the right answer is a that is palpitations due to increased blood volume and heart rate mild palpitation mild palpitations are common and usually harmless 
क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी फाइव विच लंग कैपेसिटी डिक्रीजेस ड्यूरिंग प्रेगनेंसी टाइडल वॉल्यूम रेजिडल वॉल्यूम वाइटल कैपेसिटी और टोटल लंग कैपेसिटी The right answer is B. That is residual volume. The diaphragm is pushed upward by the uterus. This reduces residual air left in the lungs. Question number twenty-six. During pregnancy, the blood becomes more viscous, more alkaline, slightly hypercoagulable, or diluted with water only. The right answer is C. That is slightly hypercoagulable. Clotting factors increase to prevent hemorrhage during delivery. The state protects against excessive bleeding. Question number twenty-seven. A normal psychological change in pregnancy is hallucination, mood swings, memory loss, or aggression. The right answer is D. That is mood swings, hormonal fluctuations, and emotional stress lead to mood changes. These are normal during pregnancy. Question number twenty-eight: Which gastrointestinal symptom is common in late pregnancy? Two options are heartburn, increased appetite, diarrhea, or flatulence. The right answer is A. That is hard one. The uterus pushes the stomach upward. Relaxation of the esophageal sphincter causes the acid reflux. Question number twenty-nine: Which blood component increases most during pregnancy? Plasma, hemoglobin, white blood cells, or platelets? The correct answer is A. That is plasma. Plasma volume expands by up to fifty percent. This supports circulation to the fetus and placenta. Question number thirty: Which posture change is common in late pregnancy? Two options are kyphosis, lordosis, scoliosis, or straight spine. The right answer is B. That is lordosis. The spine curves inward to balance body weight. This helps maintain posture as the abdomen enlarges. Great work, dear students! You have successfully completed part two of our midwifery series. That is physiological changes during pregnancy. So don't miss the next video. It is going to be very interesting and important for your upcoming exams. And my dear friends, if you found today's session helpful, then do like, share, and subscribe to Dear Competitive Exams. Don't forget to follow our Facebook page, Dear Competitive Exams, where we post daily quizzes, updates, and exam tips to keep you fit for upcoming exams. The link is in description. So please go and follow our page. So friends, keep learning, keep growing, and I will see you in the next part. Until that, take care.